welcome back coming to the assignment 2 of an introduction to artificial intelligence and the last day to submit this assignment is 7th february and uh, let's see the questions one by one consider the vacuum world illustration as covered in the videos i assume that now there are three rooms and two room roombas and uh, autonomous uh, robotic vacuum cleaners each room can either dirty clean and each roomba is present in one of the three rooms what is what are the number of uh, states in a proposition and factored knowledge representation 3 square uh, into 2 square 9 into 4 and what are, which of the following is a part of a node state a path cost from initial state parent node full duplicated detection can reduce the number of nodes to be visited from a uh, exponential to linear that is false start from uh, state a goal state is g the number over which each uh, edge indicates the cost to transition from one state to another what is the order of nodes visited bfs the order of the nodes is a c b e d f g and uh, start from a goal state is g the number of over each edge indicates the cost of the transition one state to another what is the cost of the path given by the bfs that is 32 and consider the given graph what is the order of the nodes visited by iddfs so the start state is a and goal state is e goal state is e so start state is a a c b d f and e So, which of the following state is typically not modeled as a search problem? Stock market prediction, predicting the stock prices using historical data and trends. Which of the following is true for a such tree with a finite branching factor and all costs greater than 1? Additive deepening search is a systematic uniform cost search is optimal. Suppose that there is only one state, goal state and each step cost is k. Which of the following such algorithms will return the optimal path? Uniform cost search. Which of the following uh, statements are false regarding the search? If uh, m greater greater than d, first one, second one, and third one. Now you can submit your answers. And uh, once the answers are submitted, you can uh, see assessment submitted. And uh, if you have any doubts regarding the answers, you can comment in the comments so that we can come up with the better answers. Based on the discussion, we can uh, come. Uh, we can conclude the answers. Thank you and we will meet in the assignment 3.